is how to install CentOS. I have seen many videos uh, installing the Ubuntu image on the C2. I will be exploring here for installation of CentOS. First of all, you have to come to this panel like uh, launch uh, EC2 launch panel and uh, we'll start with the launch instance here. So I'm saying here CentOS demo. I'm giving the instance name and uh, here I will browse the M MIs and we'll go to the community and uh, here I will search for uh, CentOS sometimes it's helpful CentOS is uh, also a good flavor of Linux so you can see like uh, CentOS uh, is here so you can choose when any of image from the verified provider verified provider means like the provider who uh, who is having the stack verified provider they have good images and uh, the support as well so i will select one from the verified provider uh, you can also see here the uh, so i selected the amis i am installing on the t2 uh, micro instance because it's uh, currently free tier so i will be installing here and uh, i will select the e pair is not here so i will create one CentOS demo and after creation it will ask me to save the key file TM. I will save the file here in the downloads folder I have saved and I will be selecting I will allow SSH and HTTPS as well here it says like uh, EBS volume uh, it's taking to so let it take 50 GB and uh, I don't know why 50 GB I will say like 20 GB and one is uh, around uh, 10 GB let's say okay root volume one is root volume and one is abs volume it's taking so now i will launch the instance and okay i missed uh, one thing like uh, it started with the m5 large because uh, centos is a bit uh, it takes a bit heavy resource CentOS so launch failed okay like an error occurred or attempt to get manually subscription and run them to choose the retry okay need to edit the config file again here have to give here the t2 if it works on this okay it's installing with the oracle database client so image is uh, image requirement is not fulfilled let me uh, choose the other other ami from the community it was not supported so what i will do i will select this one cloud cloud image sftp centos banner removed because this was the uh, image with uh, okay so okay a security group uh, will be worried and two customs will be deleted old image and this one okay confirm changes t2 micro i am running and uh, allowing it with the http and https again it's added like uh, 50 gb and the free tire i am eligible only for 30 gb okay let's see what happens okay launching subscribing to marketplace mis
so once it's complete then my CentOS will run with the uh, IC2 each of the uh, OS different OS has different uh, uh, different type of uh, installation mechanism like Ubuntu supports uh, app app to get install or app install and uh, CentOS supports yum yum install and the package name this fully instance is launched and uh, I'll be redirected to the instance page okay so here it's the uh, impending state while it's creating the instance let's see the center demo panel if it appear okay now it's running i get the ip and uh, Yes, mode zero four zero zero downloads centos.pm ssh minus i downloads centos. I think the root will be the username. Actually, let's see if it allow me to connect. Okay, so I am here. If I have to see the uh, uh, OS name which is installed, let me see how. Okay. Name. So it says like Linux kernel something is installed here. How I will get the actual name? Let me see the command lsb lsb underscore release hyphen a no command found. LSB first name CTL yeah so I can see here like uh, finally I got the command host name CTL it says like uh, static host name is this one and icon name is computer VM uh, church is VM machine ID is this one boot ID this one visualization Zen operating system is CentOS uh, CPOS name is CP CentOS 7 kernel version is 3.10 architecture is uh, x86 64-bit that means 64-bit so this is how the CentOS is installed now uh, thanks for watching subscribe for more videos and keep supporting me thanks for watching please subscribe and press the bell icon for the latest updates